The popular burger chain didn't even make it 24 hours. The insane demand forced the new White Castle to shut down for two and a half hours to catch up. Action News anchor Don Guevara is live on the strip with uh, more on the story about not enough of a good thing. Don. Absolutely, Steve. Tonight at 11 o'clock and there is still a line outside of White Castle. Look at all these people waiting about 30 minutes to get a burger. Now, earlier in the day, the line actually extended around the corner here of this Walgreens, but tonight it's not that bad. But again, still about a 30 minute wait. And there were some problems earlier today because at around 1245, White Castle tweeted that they had to shut down because they were getting too overwhelmed. But at around 315, they opened the doors and they were back and ready for business. The White Castle production line okay. back up and running. These tiny burgers brought massive crowds to their new location on the strip. The demand for the sliders, more than the 24 hour restaurant could handle on day two. Overwhelming. It was just, it's, it's phenomenal. So we did choose to shut down this morning just to kind of regroup, clean things up, give our team members a break. We're in the kitchen, White Castle Central, and since they're opening yesterday, management tells me that White Castle has served more than 50,000 burgers here in Vegas. Vegas is the farthest west White Castle has ever gone. The company started in Wichita, Kansas. It's a Midwest favorite. I grew up on White Castles in Detroit and just love them. Chris Gittersunke now lives in Summerlin. Vegas has been his home for 20 years. For him, a 30 minute wait, worth it. What if I just took you to In-N-Out or brought you McDonald's or something? Oh, no way, no way, not even close. At the very back of this line, oh, West Coast, my castle. controlled by hired security, Enjoy, have a good evening. Joe Haas waits. From Cleveland, he now lives in Henderson, but also grew up eating White Castle. They're pretty much everywhere, so it's been a long time coming to get them out here, and uh, we're happy to have them. And you're looking at the 30-pack here at Sliders. They all come in these cute, they're little small ones, cute little individually wrapped uh, little burgers there. Cheese, onion, this one was borrowed. Thank you so much. So White Castle says that maybe tomorrow, the next day, if things be continue to be this busy, they may have to take those little breaks in the morning, shut down for a little bit, restock, catch up, so that they can continue serving this new location here on the Las Vegas Strip. And that is where we are live tonight. I'm Don Guevara, Channel 13 Action News.